Hello guys and welcome to a new brand video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create power form on DocuSign. And now the first thing that you will need to do is to open your web browser. Either it was Google Chrome, Mozilla Firefox, Brave or any web browser that you are using. And then you will need just to go uh, to your searching bar or the URL bar. And then you will need to search for DocuSign. So basically you will need either to click and add the whole URL of the website or you can just search for it here on Google and you will find the first link. So basically make sure that is DocuSign.com. You click on it and now we will need to create an account. So basically we will need just to click on login here. So basically uh, either you can click on get uh, started and let's get started. You will need uh, to add your email and basically uh, you will need just to add the email agree on the terms accept the cookies and basically i'm going just to add my email here and then i will uh, i think i confirmed by mistake and basically you will need just to add the email you agree get started and then you will need just to click until, uh, until it's verify you will add your personal uh, info so i'm just doing this like this you can add a phone number and then uh, so you need just to add a valid phone number and then you will need just to click on uh, next and basically after that you will need just to verify your account so you will receive a verification code you add the verification code and then you will be able to check your email and then uh, you will be able to sign in to your account on DocuSign and now we will need just to click on next and we will confirm our account and basically now our account is being created you will need just to add your own password for the account and then click on next and basically now we have finished creating the account and basically all you need to do now is to follow these simple steps and as you can see this is our account that's being started and now you can either finish your setup by adding your industry etc or you can just skip these uh, steps etc so basically we have finished our account so the first thing that you need to have now is to have the privileges or the permissions of an administrator so if you are an administrator all you need to do to create a power form is to go here to do your templates. So basically you need just to go to your templates and then you will need just to go to uh, here in the actions. And basically in the actions, you will find uh, the create a power form. So basically after creating a power form, you will need to give it a name, an email subject and some instruction if you have. After that, after completing all uh, the fields, you will need just uh, to go to select an option if you require an email validation etc and then you will need just to create it and then you will have your url link and then you can just share your power form with other users so basically this is how you can do it thank you for watching and see you next time